I'm here with Ilias. He's uh, he's taken his dad to the football. I love that. <laughs> he's a big fan of the channel and he loves the Europa League theme tune as well. Your dad was saying how much he liked that. But listen, Ilias, a really, really good win for us in the end. We just don't keep, um, we don't stop fighting, do we? We always manage to find a way to win. Yes, like when we're countering and tucking, we always find that way to just bend it in and always score. Exactly. And then we're keeping our winning streak clear and not conceding any goals. Exactly. And that's the main thing. Exactly. And even and come coming to it. And even though we conceded one, we just never give up. Our, our team spirit is always there. And Ganacho, he's probably not much older than you to be honest. Um, he scores a great goal for us. How how happy was you to see him score that goal? I was delighted and thrilled to yes. see him. I think that's his like third goal of the season. And for him only being 18 and being at that level is brilliant. Yes, exactly. And what about in midfield? Because at half time, Eric Ten Hag brought on Casemiro. Did you think that Casemiro helped us play better? Casemiro played, helped us play brilliant. Yes. Once he came on, it made a massive difference for us. And that, and that made us manage to win. How old are you? Eight. Eight. Ilias is eight. How amazing is he actually? That is unbelievable. This is, yeah, you got a, I'm going to go talk to your daddy. You stay right there. What a kid. Um, yeah, yeah. I mean, you've got him out here supporting us, yeah, and yeah. it's just a great time to be a United fan right now. We, the performances might not be perfect, mm -hmm. but we just keep going. You know, you know, it is. It's, uh, it's credit to Ten Hag. That's what it is. Credit to him. Um, when we're playing, even I think when we've seen the team sheet, first of all, we all went, oh, Maguire, Lindersoft. We thought, oh, <laughs> no, man. We knew what exactly was going to happen. But I think because of all the games that we've played, you know, we had to beat Barcelona twice, um, uh, a cup final. final. Everyone has to get a game. You know, this is why we have a squad. Um, so I guess we had to see the changes. I didn't think he was going to make that many changes, mm. but he did make the changes. So I understood it. But you see when he makes the changes again, Casemiro makes a big difference. I feel sorry for Scott McTominay because really, I don't think he's going to be here next season. But um, like the gentleman said before, one of them has to go. It's either Scott or Fred. One of them had to step up. Mm. And Fred's the one that's been stepping up. So, um, And then even more changes, you know. Martinez it, comes Martinez, in yeah, just to give that balance. The, the, butcher, yeah. the butcher, the baker, the candlestick <laughs> maker. You know, he, he comes on and he makes a big difference. It's, it's about feeding the ball through the lines. And you kind of know what Maguire's going to do when he's on the ball. You know, he's going to take a touch. He's going to take another touch. He's pointing over here and he's telling people what to do. But really, it feels like no one's really... Um, taking him as a commander, as a leader, but when Bruno's playing and he's the captain, people seem to respond more mm. and, and he's, there's a lot more confidence on the pitch when, when he's a captain uh, rather than Maguire. Mm. It's, it's mental, my boy. And you can, see it, you can see it going through the team, can't you, in terms yeah. of the, when, the, when the, f the first selection of players come on the first team, if you want to yeah. call it that, the levels, the levels uh, just, just go up, don't they? Yeah, it's a completely different. Um, Elias, I'm going to come to you, back to you, right? So we've got Fulham in the next round of the FA Cup. Do you think we can win the FA Cup and get two cups this season? We'll batter Fulham oh. and then get past them and then go to the final and then win our next FA Cup. Look at that, he's confident. He's a, and I'll tell you what then, well, I may as well ask him for the clean sweep then, because I'll tell you what, in the Europa League, we've got Real Betis, your favourite theme tune, which you, I'll tell you, I, do you know what? We're going to have to make a new Champions League song just for you, so you can like that one, because we're not going to be in the Europa League next season. But we've got Real Betis in the Europa League as well. What are we going to do in that cup? Smash them as well. <laughs> well, and we got Liverpool on the weekend. <laughs> what are we going to do to them? Smash them. <laughs> <laughs> Elias, before we go, because you are an absolute champion, my man, um, who was your man of the match today? Who was your best player on the pitch today? I think it was Garnacho. Yeah. Double step, chop, cross it in and bending it into the net. Look at this kid. Good man. You get yourself home. Listen, Dad. Thank you, man. Thank you so much, man. What a guy. Little Elias, what a guy.